is Mai, where we bring on a mystery guest who has a close connection to one of our panellists. This week, each of Lee's team will claim it's them that has the genuine connection to the guest. And it's up to David's team to spot who's telling the truth. So please welcome this week's special guest, John. Yep, yep, that's John. Yep. Right, uh, Miles, <laughs> first of all, uh, what, what is John to you? Uh, John and I were paid to fight together in a supermarket dressed as... <laughs> <laughs> dressed as gladiators. Kate, how do you know John? This is John, and uh, when I was in Africa, he and I dressed up in a pantomime giraffe costume in order to get close-up shots of giraffes in the wild. Uh, Lee, what is your relationship with John? This is John. Despite being total strangers, we were once forced to share a bed when we were double-booked into the same hotel room. <laughs> David, where do you want to start? Um, well, maybe with Kate, because... What I'm reluctant to believe mm. is that the best way of lulling giraffes <laughs> into a false sense of security is to try and disguise yourself as a giraffe, because I reckon they'd... I mean, they'd, a giraffe, it takes one to know one. You <laughs> say that, but we have all seen Carl Pilkington and Warwick Davis... Davis? I think so. Going into a panda enclosure dressed as pandas, which was weird. So, I can believe it. He thought that if we dressed up as a giraffe, then he could put the camera on a kind of periscope thing up the neck of the giraffe yeah. and get that evening shot um, of the giraffes against the sunset. Yeah. Now, you said very astutely yeah. that it takes a giraffe to know a giraffe. Yeah. If we tried to do this in daylight, it would have failed completely because giraffes have extremely good day vision, but their night vision isn't very good, and that's why we decided to try it. Don't they sleep why at night? Why is it then necessary to disguise as a giraffe at all? Why not just take a stepladder? <laughs> they are not completely blind. They're just not necessarily going to worry too much about whether you're made out of polyester or real fur. Do you um, just show us how, how it, you did how this? It works. How it works. Would you like me to do that with John? This guy is Lee would be huge. the perfect Lee. partner okay, for this. Lee, if you come... he, has, he has a look of the come, wild about him. Here. Kate's going to demonstrate yeah. the whole giraffe so, doppelganger with you, Lee. So you are in the front, OK? You need to stand about there. Mm -hmm. And um, actually, could you three stand up and all just be giraffes in the wild with yes. the sun behind you? <laughs> yes. Okay. Do you ever get the feeling she's mocking us? <laughs> Okay, so you've got this big giraffe costume on and it's yeah. got a kind of pole up the back as its spine. Right. You yeah. have got a camera on a pole poking out of the mouth of the giraffe, right, towards right. them, OK? Right. I am behind you. <laughs> nope. Nope. Kate, Kate, at, at what point do you say action? I've got the laptop. You know why I say nope? The other day I saw a video of a... Baby giraffe, baby, okay? It was, I, like, it was a day old, like, I don't know. It was tiny, it was adorable, it was so cute. Next to mama in, like, some enclosure. And <clears throat> on the wall of the enclosure, actually it was the doorway of the enclosure while the baby walks in, they had, um, measuring tape a measuring thing where they have like so many feet you know like the criminals they got to tell how high they are how tall they are how high they are <laughs> how tall they are um how high they are is a different method but anyway and the baby walking through again just like just born it was puny it was adorable just walking casually through it was higher than five feet so it was taller than me and it was, again, baby, baby. And baby giraffe was about a quarter, maybe less, of mama giraffe. Now, I've seen giraffes before in the zoo, in person. They are extremely freaking tall. So, the fact that she did the horsey thing where you bend over and blah, 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 that makes no sense. If they actually dressed up, I know this sounds so stupid, the fact that I'm actually thinking of talking about this, but whatever, okay? 
just bear with me again um if she didn't do the bend over thing um and she would just chill and walk like that and would have said that you know i walk normally because giraffes are freaking massive i would have believed her but they ended up what dressing up as the tiniest freaking giraffe ever that's gonna be suspicious all right so just saying here <laughs> Right. So I'm checking the focus and what? saying the laptop here. Oh. At what point do you say on her head? action? I've got the laptop here. Right. So I'm checking the focus and saying to John, OK, you're nicely framed up. <laughs> That's looking lovely. There was a By the way, I'm a meerkat. Excellent. You're doing a very good job. I think that's. I think that's Is made that, it a lot clearer. Let's say big thank you to our giraffes. <laughs> yeah. Most of all, a big round of applause for our meerkat. <laughs> <laughs> right. Who would you like to question next? Uh, yes, Miles. You had to dress up as a, a gladiator. A gladiator. Yeah. Oh, as oh, a... Also, while I'm at it, she said she like bent down like that. That guy is freaking huge. Did you see when she stood up next to the guy? Like, if she bent over, she'd be at his freaking knees, man. Like, that makes no sense. That 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 didn't happen. If it happened, I don't know. But to me, that didn't happen. A Roman gladiator. Dress up as a, a gladiator. A gladiator. Yeah. As in a Roman gladiator, or as in from the TV show Gladiator. <laughs> uh, I, I Roman, Roman gladiator. So, it's a sort of sword and sandals. Yeah, uh, breastplates. What sort of gladiator were you? We each had a sword and a shield, and we, we did battle. And this was in a supermarket? <laughs> yes. And what, were you employed, or was this just... We were, we were in... For some or a distraction <laughs> technique, yeah, exactly. so that someone else could steal bits and cakes. <laughs> <laughs> we I like that the guy's laughing so much. <laughs> Why? I must have... <laughs> we were promoting a range of foods. <laughs> fresh, fresh, fresh lion meat, meat. <laughs> you know, the usual. We were, we were promoting uh, a, a range of foods, the Viva Italia delicatessen range. I, I don't know if you remember when Safeways rolled that out. Um, <laughs> and we, would, we would have this fight, and then one of us would uh, die, uh, or be beaten, be vanquished, and the other one would say, Oh, how, how did you get the strength to beat me? And you'd say, from aisle seven, where... <laughs> <laughs> where, I've been, where I've been feasting on the, uh, the Italia, the Viva Italia uh, Delicatessen. <laughs> what about Lee? Lee, remind us, what is your link to John? I've forgotten. Uh, this is John. Yes. And we were once forced to share a hotel room together. or we'll share a bed in a hotel room because we've been double booked. Um, so where was the hotel, Lee? The hotel was uh, in Scotland. OK. And any, do you want to be more specific than that? OK. It was <laughs> right in Scotland. <laughs> <laughs> OK. In the middle. Specific? More specific? Yeah. We, I was at Alice Guy. <laughs> I believe you. I, I was... What were you, what, were you, what, were you doing, what were you doing? I was uh, at a wedding. Yeah, when was this wedding? Nine years ago. You came back from the... You came back from the wedding, so, so it was I came late, back from the wedding. Got to the hotel. I had a bit too much to drink. Right. I go to reception, I say, hello. Uh, I'm... I'm... Well, I'd have to say. And, um... Nine years ago. <laughs> yes, you were. Right, right. <laughs> But so I told them who I was. She, she leans round, she gives me the key, I go upstairs. No lift. Right. She there. doesn't in any way go, by the way, there is a large man already <laughs> in this room. No, obviously, she wasn't aware of the mix-up, otherwise she would have stopped me, wouldn't she? She didn't... As I walked off, she didn't go... Did the guy the just nod? Up, otherwise, she would have stopped me, wouldn't she? She didn't... As I walked off, she didn't go... <laughs> <laughs> what? Nothing, nothing. <laughs> You'll see. Nah. So, so what happened? You... you you were given the key by reception and yes. then opened the door and he was in. For some reason it makes me so happy when the, the this is my guest laughs and stuff and just you can tell they're having a good time being there. I really like that. I know they're not supposed to emote or anything, but I just I it makes me happy. Oops. Nah. Correct. <laughs> the, what? <laughs> opened the door and he was in there. Ah. Correct. <laughs> the, <laughs> 
<laughs> At which point you said... I was a bit drunk, so I just assumed that there'd been a mix-up, wrong key, I was in the wrong room, so I just went, oh, sorry. And he went, oh, 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 and I thought, I can't remember He said what? He went, oh, oh sorry. <laughs> you don't mock him, wait till he opens his mouth in a minute. <laughs> To, to, to I, say, used, I said, you've given me the wrong key. Yeah. Then she said, sorry, there's, there's, she, there's been a mix-up. Been a mix-up. Uh, and she said... Uh, the, You're uh, going been, to have to go back in there. <laughs> I was in the right room. He was in the wrong room. But he checked in earlier on. So it wasn't her mistake. It was a mistake early on by somebody else. Why didn't you investigate the possibility of sharing with the person in the other room? Oh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> what I did was I went around all the rooms. <laughs> 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 I don't think so, do you? <laughs> You're looking out, soldier. When you realise, when the two of you realise that... Uh, oh, my God, to... dude, the way that guy smiles and laughs just makes me happy. He's having out, such soldier. a good time. Look at him. When you realise, when the two of you realise that uh, you were going to have to share a bed together, mm -hmm. did you have a kind of a negotiation? I have never been to bed with anyone where negotiations have been involved. That's not completely true. <laughs> but, um... <laughs> Did you say, did you say, for example, I like, I like to sleep on this side of the bed? I'm happiest on the right-hand side? Uh, before um, we I'm... got to that point, we both tried to not sleep in the same bed. I didn't just go, what the hell are you doing? I'm going to sleep on the left and you can sleep on the right, <laughs> didn't I? <laughs> right, so we need an answer. What do you think? I really don't know. Whatever we say, if we get it wrong, we'll look like we've believed something ridiculous. <laughs> I don't believe that the best way of photographing <laughs> giraffes at sunset <laughs> is to disguise yourself as a giraffe. I don't... I just... just pe two actors fighting it's in a super... But, but why? If you're pushing a range of sort of <laughs> Italian delicatessen <laughs> foods, are you going to imply that they give you gladiatorial strength? Well, it's straight that's, to kill somebody. That's not, that's not what yeah, you're people are looking for in that kind of... in a nice bit of pastrami. Or will, but will it be able to give me the strength to murder? <laughs> <laughs> and also, don't you think that John looks like the kind of bloke you would bump into at a Scottish wedding? <laughs> See, I, I, I know it sounds weird. I kind of believe... Kate's version you? more. Yeah, you think I, Lee? I think Lee, yeah. I think Lee. But what if it's Miles then? I think it's Miles. <laughs> then that's awful. It's Miles then. <laughs> We're going to say Lee. You're going to say Lee. I think it's Miles. It's weird, but I think it's Miles. I just. I, I, I already explained the giraffe thing. And then. I don't know, the Lee Mac thing, I guess, is plausible from stuff I've heard him say that ended up being true. But I got a feeling it's Miles. The, the wedding, the bed, the night together. Yes! So, John, would you please reveal your true identity? I'm John, and I was once paid to fight Miles in a suit. Yay! <laughs> awesome. <laughs> Yeah, John and Miles were paid to fight each other in a supermarket while dressed as gladiators. I think it's a horrible, stupid game. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you very much, yeah, John. That was great. Thank you. you know, I was half expecting him to speak, open his mouth and speak, and sound like Lee Max said, oh, <laughs> just like that much. But, uh, good, good. <laughs>